Picket with Purpose A picket line is one of the strongest tactics at worker's disposal. Even though the law does not recognize our right to stop traffic, moral people will not cross our picket lines. Even if the picket line's only purpose is to publicize an injustice or air a simple demand, it is not taken lightly. Unfortunately, however, individual picketers often forget the importance of their purpose. The problem usually is the social nature of the action. People tend to group up and flirt or exchange conversations rather than keeping their minds on their purpose. Others simply aren't thinking about optimizing the tactic's effectiveness. Some just don't know how to pick it. For that last group, here are a few tips. Number one, remember why you are picketing. Keep your picket signs up and facing your target audience. Number two, maintain an even distance between yourself and the person in front. Even three people can make a decent picket line if they pay attention. Usually, two or three paces is a good distance. Many times, organizers make the mistake of setting a picket from a certain point A to another point B without regard to the number of picketers. It's better to have a uniform picket over a short distance than a long picket with big gaps in it. Number three, stay in single file. Avoid the temptation to socialize. Number four, remember that picket sounds may be just as important as appearances. Keep up the chanting. Number five, avoid staring at reporters or TV cameras, but maintain consciousness of them. Remember, too, that TV cameras are equipped with microphones, and news programs are much more likely to use clips that have both good visual and good audio. Number six, stay on target. If you aren't designated to talk to reporters, Avoid it. Number seven, keep moving. Set a good example for the newer picketers who are less experienced. Number eight, make sure that your signs and the signs of others are on target with the purpose of the event. Picket with purpose.